What's going on YouTube and Umbrella Academy fans? By now, I'm hoping that these episodes are rolling out and if they aren't, then uh, anyway, we are back again for the Umbrella Academy and today's question of the day is going to be, who do you feel more bad for? Harlan for the life he was forced to grow up in or the Sparrow Academy members, Jamie and Alfonso, who just got their face, faces exploded. That Harlan montage at the beginning of the episode was like really, really sad. Also, let me know what your theories are on how Five started the commission. I'm really interested to see uh, what you guys think about that. I think the show is completely crazy and balls to the wall for doing this, but it also feels so right, you know what I mean? You can find my full episode reaction to this one on Patreon, as well as the full season of Umbrella Academy right now, if you wish to support the channel. You can follow along for $5 a month and get access to polls and also have your name Features at the end of the video. Like and subscribe if you want to see more of my content, and here's the video. Oh wow. Oh my god. <laughs> oh damn it. Oh, uh, she's getting sick. Damn, they really had to move a lot. October 1st, 1981. Oh shit. Oh, this is crazy sad, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're donezo. And Sloan just barely made it out of that. What did you do? Did Victor go full carry again? We didn't do this. You can you can talk now. That's I can do a lot of things now. That's to get Victor saved in Dallas. Oh, oh shit, you're right. But didn't he get rid of all the kids' mojo when he did all that? <laughs> Where is this? Wait a minute. I'm gonna go check the infinite switchboard. And I'll check This is the commission, holy shit. But what time, what, what point in time is this? That's weird. Like the past or the future? Sloan? Oh my god. Sloan! What are you doing? Did you set me up? No. I would never do that. I would drop him. Good. All right. Let's go. Hey, Diego. It's okay. You can let her go now. I said let her go. She's hurt. She is the enemy. If you hurt her, I will bury you. You're going to bury me too, Luther? Just... Just let me talk to her. Okay? Please. Trust me. She's going to talk. Oh, God damn it. This sound effect is playing so hard on my ears right now. Oh. oh my God. Nah, chill out. That shit, that shit needs to come with a headphones warning, bro. I heard a rumor. Whoa, well, Allison, hey. You're going to tell me the truth. Where's the briefcase? What's going on? I don't know! Allison! We left it in your house, and it is our only way out of this. Enough! <laughs> You better ask yourself which side you on, bro. Would you just get the hell out of here? Can you tell me what to do now? All of you, just get out! Yo, the family dichotomy right now is a little bit... Oof. Don't know who to really fuck with right now. Allison becoming the villain of this season. That's crazy. I heard a rumor. <laughs> I had always wondered if she could rumor herself, and it seems like she can, but it's very hard. And what is she about to do? Okay. <laughs> Victor. All right. Went the soccer route and cut her hair. What do we do now? What's our next move? I'm sorry. I, I can't. I can't deal with this right this second. We can talk later, okay? No. Not okay. Later, please. It's very hard for Allison to deal with all of this. Victor becoming his own person and Allison feeling so alone in everything that she's going through. Yeah, but I'm a different kind of number one. Mm, the shitty kind. That's why he <laughs> promoted you. That's why he made Marcus number one. You don't know how to lead. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Marcus would have never He's let gone. You know what a real problem is? You. 
You're a shit number two, Faye. <laughs> See? Even Christopher agrees with me. I wish they had subtitles for Chris, because... That's all Faye gonna do? It doesn't alarm you at all, the fact that they're drugging their father. Wish we would've all right. Who are these weird people the, the camera keeps you panning to in the hotel? All right, so now I'm thinking like maybe this is what's left of the commission after season two, but it's swallowing everything. Well, my sweet dog, Iris, Joshua McCowney, they're all gone. I've tried everything. I don't know what else to do. The timeline is collapsing. Ah! Oh. This is the end. Ah! Holy shit. I hate your family. That's cool. Not a super fan of yours right now. Are you a part of it? Of what? Ambushing us with Superman's grandpa. Sloan, my family <laughs> can't decide what... I don't really have any friends. Or romances. I just have my family. And I would do anything to protect them. Except betray you. Because that's not who I want to be. So, if you're playing me right now, you win. But if this, if this is for real, we have to trust each other. Because we're not our families. Listen, despite all the relationships this show has had, when Luther takes the wheel, that's my man right there. Rumor me again. Go on, not hiding anything, whatever it takes. Do whatever the hell you want to do, Luther. That's on you. I've got bigger shit to deal with. I'm not a fan of Alice in this season. I understand, but <clears throat> sorry, I'm just. It's just mm. a bunch of Five. Why would he randomly fart? He's scratching. Who's there? Yo, is it the old five from nine from, who got sent back to 2019? Is he the reason why something's fucking up? People in there hate people like us. Get a drink. See if they start something. Uh oh. Me damn sure we finish it. Diego, you instigator. Look at him. <laughs> Eye recognition. Who put him here? It's me. So this whole time you've been complaining about the commission and <laughs> you're the one who founded it. Classic. If I did, <laughs> I have no memory of it. So you must be here because of... Blitz. Is that like a cheese blitz? It's German for ball of lightning. How do we fix it? <laughs> you don't. If you created all of this, then you must have created a solution. What will be left is oblivion. Oblivion. What do you mean? Don't save the world. Come on. Can I have the room? Mm, I don't think I should leave you too long. Lila, either. I need the room. What's he gonna do? No, oh, he's missing a whole arm. What the hell? What's this? This guy's gonna skin his own body. This is so cool. Oh, oh f 
Of course, bro. A f kid is always gonna do some shit like this. You gotta be kidding me, bro. Oh, shit. Come on, Klaus. Manifest your powers in a way we've never seen before, please. One of these fucking sonically gifted motherfuckers are gonna heal Klaus. They're gonna use their psycho ass powers. To Victor or Harlan, they're gonna fix him. It's gotta be. Whoa, is he getting like thrown into a loop? Just seeing that they're all looking for their moms or something? What's going on? Just chill out, bro. Why do you have these? Huh? Why? Do you know them? Yo, wait, this this was from the first episode. How the hell did that happen? It was you. You killed our mothers. You caused all of this. Yo, Victor don't even know how to stand. That shit was crazy. Holy shit, bro. I mean, obviously a being like Harlan just existing when he shouldn't have. That was already enough. Gosh, there's so much going on here. Like, when did Five actually become the founder of the thing? Like, was it... Like, it, it's crazy. Like, oh my god. See, this is why you don't time travel. Because it all fucks up. Oh my god. I am so fascinated to find out how the hell... Could Harlan have ever simultaneously killed all the moms of the Umbrella Academy at the same t at the same point his mom died? But that's what I'm thinking, like, because we've seen at the start of this season, uh, only 16 children were born. Like, uh, did Harlan kill more than just the seven Umbrella Academy's mothers? Or like, what? This is so crazy. Oh, God, what a crazy ass episode. Uh, can't wait to get into more. If you guys enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'll catch you in the next one. So take care of yourselves. And of course, as usual, please have yourselves a damn good one. <laughs>